kicked them back into the top six and that meant Inverness dropped out. They'd been in action at home on Saturday against the team which started the day in third place, Dundee United. Two changes for Craig Brewster with Phil Maguire and Dougie Imrie replacing Proctor and Wynas. Don Cowie played just behind Marius Nikolai in attack. Craig Levine freshened things up after the midweek cup defeat by St Mirren. Dylan, Kenneth and Granger all returning to the back four with Prince Boban into midfield and Jim O'Brien up front with Mark De Vries. Hunt, Conway, Dodds and Robertson were all on the bench. The commentary from Jock Brown. Granger's in trouble here against Emery. Good angle ball, fine play. There's Cowie. Excellent play from Cowie. And what a relief there for Danny Granger. Gave possession away there and could have been punished very easily indeed. Emery doing so well going inside. And then that very fine angle pass into the path of Cowie. His shot just going wide. This is Swanson. Away from Black, setting up O'Brien. Hastings very tight on him here. O'Brien keeping possession well. Supported now by Dylan. This is Gomez. Dylan to Hunt. It's good play. Well, that's great play by Dundee United. Prince Bourbon scores. United take the lead. Excellent build up play. The ball turned back by O'Brien for Dylan. Dylan playing it into Hunt. Now Hunt did so well here to make space for himself for the ball, driven across the face of goal. And there was Bourbon to turn it in to give United the lead. Self done by Bain. Emery turning it back for Bain again. It's a good attempt. Well saved. A superbly controlled volley that by Graham Bain. Howie playing it through a gap there for McBain. Poor shot in the end, a very good opportunity created by that fine move. Disappointment for Cali. There's four minutes plus stoppage time remaining. This is Roy McBain drifting inside more and more to get involved in the play. Angling that in for Bain. It reaches past the line and he's equalised! There was going to be one more chance you felt for Cali Thistle, and it's Marcus Patalainen who's taken it. Bain chasing here, it's held up. Zaluska did well. He had a chance for Cali to win it. Kenneth on the line, good defending. Very good finish to the match, this. Both sides going for the winner. Well, Zaluska was certainly stranded. I said to them at half time, a bit more momentum and about things, and we did that right from the start, albeit we, we didn't create too many clear cut chances. It was just that final pass, maybe just behind or, or too far in front. I've got a lot of people who are injured and struggling with this thing and that thing, and uh, we needed some fresh legs. And we had fresh legs today. I mean, I thought the full backs were both excellent. And, uh, you know, Jim O'Brien playing up front, loads of energy, and, uh, you know, once we knew how to, to play with them, then we did a little bit better. My target's always trying to catch the team above us, and uh, we just have to keep playing away, trying to put good performances on, and you never know where we'll, we'll finish. Quite frustrating for Dundee United, John. 1-0 uh, up away from home and uh, pulled back six minutes from time. Yeah, I'm not sure whether Craig Levine will be, you know, obviously going away from home. Most managers are sometimes happy with a point, but I've, I've been took the lead. Mm. Um, and we're playing quite well when they took the lead. You know, I'm not too sure whether he'd be overly pleased with drawing the game. Uh, and it's, you know, you look at the league table as it stands now. We, Dundee United really, if they're going to be challenging Motherwell for third place with Motherwell's games in hand, you know, they need to. Uh, this is a game that they could have done with, with taking all three points. Yeah, Jimmy freshened the team up beforehand, but it wasn't until they brought Noel Hunt back into the lineup that he got the breakthrough. Yeah, and it was a terrific goal. All the ball, ball played on the floor all the way. Love a little. Uh, passes and then a good turn by, by No Hunt and across the face of the mm. goal and Prince Bowman breaking from midfield and tucking it in and it was a, it was a very well worked goal. Marius Patalainen is looking for a new contract at Inverness. Didn't do himself too much harm on Saturday by grabbing the equaliser. Took it well, John. Yeah, big Lee Wilkie's unlucky there. You know he has a centre. He goes. He wants to head the ball away, but it comes. It comes back off 
off the lad and he makes a great run in there and he just puts puts the full back off coming across and that's, that's what's obviously give the lad the chance to score the goal but defender possibly should have done better there uh, but still he's quick on to it and it's a good finish yeah Marius Nikolai Marcus Patalainen we got it right in the end two more matches and Celtic at the top with Motherwell now third with a point and three games in hand over Dundee United Hibs go fifth with Falkirk sixth and none of those bottom six clubs managed a win this weekend. Inverness could go fifth if they win at Motherwell on Wednesday.